Hi, this is Diane Dean, and I'm uh, here today with Caroline Gunther, who owns WAG, a pet boutique. I just visited last week to get my dog Ladybug a new harness, which she's been very happy with. So Caroline, um, you're one of our sponsors for the Artscape Banner program. Do you want to talk a little bit to us about uh, that program and what you think of our arts community and also tell us a little bit about your business in these days? Sure, and thanks for having me. I have always been a big supporter of the arts. Um, I grew up as an art show kid, so both of my mother and my father uh, did art shows when I was growing up, and I traveled around with them doing them, so art has always been very near and dear to my heart. Um, my stepbrother and stepsister's mother, Costanza Knight, is the one that created the art banner program, or one of the people that created the program in the beginning. And so I'm, I'm a huge fan of public art. And when she asked, I said, of course, I'll be a part of this and be a sponsor. And I think that was four or five years ago. Is it five years now? It, this would be the fourth going into the fourth year. Okay. So four years. And we have so many wonderful artists in our community. I know a lot of artists have chosen to be here because of all of the wonderful businesses that we have and the people that make up the fabric of our community. And so I wanted to support them as members of our wonderful community. My business has been open the entire time, actually. Uh, pet food is considered essential in both the state and the county stay-at-home orders. So back in March, uh, my staff decided that they wanted to do curbside and delivery only. So that's what we moved to. And then a couple of Saturdays ago, uh, when phase one started, we were able to open back up to the public and we have been just marching along. We've done a lot of really cool things in the store. We've had a lot of really good deals and sales going on and we are definitely seeing our people around. So we've been able to serve all of our customers throughout COVID-19 and throughout the shutdown, and we are able to bring better and newer and more cool things now as a result of it. So we really worked hard during the time that we were given. Great. Well, we wish you success. We're really happy to have you a part of the Artscape program. And um, I think you're aware, but we are going to keep the banners up for two years this round. Um, we felt that all of the local businesses and really most of our sponsors are small businesses and locally run businesses and um, we just want them to be um, as strong as they can be as they move through the next two years while the banners are flying. The banners are rated for four years so we feel like we'll be in good shape and uh, we hope you'll be able to participate when we do the next round. Well I certainly hope so too. I plan on it. Great. Thanks so much, Caroline. Today I'm interviewing Lois Collier, who was chosen for the WAG uh, Pet Boutiques banner. Um, Lois, tell us a little bit about the painting that was selected for the banner. The, the, the oil painting that was selected uh, for the Artscape banner uh, is titled Silent Passage. And it, it's sort of a spiritual painting for me because uh, I love to go up into the mountains and while I'm up there something sort of magical happens. Uh, there's a there's a silence up there that you just don't find very many places on earth and it's just dear to me and I just separate from the world and and uh, I think you can call it closeness to God. And um, it's just a very spiritual experience. And I hope that I've captured it. But um, this was the first year that I just felt led to, to give it a try. And I was very, very surprised and also excited and pleased. And it also motivated me beyond belief is um, that my work got accepted. I had entered three and of the three, I was surprised at the one that got accepted. So, I was, is there a word called flabbergasted? <laughs> <laughs> well, we're happy that you're part of the program. Do you uh, plan on applying again the next round? I, I don't know. That's a good question. Um, well, of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs>
I've entered a few art competitions and, and I might have won a, a ribbon or something like that, but never anything as grand as this. I just feel this is such an honor to have my name on my work on a banner in downtown Hendersonville, the city I love. And um, uh, this particular work was, it, it sort of was a turning point for me in my work because um, I had entered it one time and it, it just, it just was a big flop. And uh, it made me really question my abilities. And um, so I had a long talk with my dear husband and he asked me, why, why do you paint? And I said, because I, I just love it and it's my passion. And he said, well, what does it matter what people think about your work? Just paint and the rest will take care of itself. The Artscape program is excited to have both WAG Pet Boutique and Lois Collier participating this year. Watch for future interviews with our sponsors and artists.